hedgehog Sonic, he can really move Sonic, he's got an attitude Sonic, he's the fastest thing alive Look out when he storms through Sonic the Hedgehog Don't doubt what he can do For fuck's sake, Shadow. I've got that door every time for the last seven weeks. Just give me a solid break. I'll get it, Lightning. You just relax and watch your Steven Universe marathon. You deserve it. Thanks, Jade. I'm real pissed off with Shadow at the moment. Oh, hi there. Is this where Prince Thunderstreak lives? Yes, it is. And can I just ask who you are? Oh, sorry, I forgot to say. I'm Lyra Heartstrings, one of Prince Thunder's close friends. I need to find a place to live since some retarded lizard decided to be a fuckwit and burn my home to the ground. We know Eskio the Chameleon well, he's burning houses down to try and build new arcades here, there, and bloody everywhere. So I'm sure they'll let you inside. Prince Thunderstrings, it's really you. You must be exhausted from coming here. I overheard what happened when you spoke to Jade. You can sit in my room if you want. And you should be okay. Flutters is in the pool out the back. I'm joining her in a minute anyway. Ah, oh, thank you, Angel Tidal Wave. Come to think of it, I'm absolutely knackered. All right, Victor, do you remember the plan? I'm sure I do. Was it to find the computer room? No, it fucking wasn't you, dickhead. It was to send in a certain hedgehog to old Prince Thunder and his friend Hostage. Oh yeah, I remember now. I have to send in Amy Rose the hedgehog to drive them insane. Once they can't take it no more, they'll take her somewhere far away, meaning we'll have time to send in a few clones to review the place. It's what Prince Thunder deserves for doing away with our loss. Oh, Angel Tidal Wave, this is so warm, I love it. But to make it better, I have the love of my life with me, and that's you. Aw, oh, you're so sweet, Flutters. This is why I can't take my mind off you. <laughs> surprise, surprise, motherfuckers! Where's Sonic? If you don't tell me, the yellow one's getting a meeting. You wouldn't do this unless you were so me. So don't chance it. Oh yeah, wanna know what happened to Tails? I put him in the hospital for not telling me, so you better speak up. This has been going on for ages, Lyra, so I know what I mean when I say she needs help. I respect that Amy Rose is your sister, but this behavior is worse than I thought. No offense or anything. I don't blame you for saying that. In fact, I'm pissed off with her. Sorry about that, you too. I know you were trying to relax. I see why you're pissed off with Amy. And thanks, Prince Thunder and Lyra, you did save us from a beating after all. We should make dinner soon, but Lyra is still sleeping, we better leave her to it. She's had a long trip, you're right, she's been asleep for two and a half hours though. But it's only worth her time if we leave her for now. Lightning's still watching this Steven Universe marathon, so he asked me to welcome you into the house. Lyra Heartstrings, I'm not surprised Prince Thunder lets you move in, you're one of his best friends after all. That's right Shockwave, and let me just say this to you. Thanks for accepting me into the house guys, you're all amazing and you know it. Especially Prince Thunderstreak, an angel tidal wave, without them I'd be living nowhere right now. Of course I'd let you live here. You helped me before, so it's only fair I help you. And also, that's the first meal I've enjoyed in quite a while. Alright, I'll admit, I'm quite good at cooking. There, I said it. I'm going to the glades with Prince Thunder soon, wanna join? The arcades? But where's there one in Croydon? No, not the arcades, the glades, it's a shopping center in Bromley which takes 20 to 30 minutes to drive there. Ooh, you've got my interest. I like the sound of that. Will we need to go food shopping? 
Actually, yes. But since our carts are only two-seaters, there's a problem. Unless, Ringo, do you want to stay behind and make the sofa in our room a bed for Lyra for when we get back? I'll need the trailer to put the food in to drive back. Yeah, I can do that. In fact, while you're food shopping, I'll make sure it's comfortable. Shadow, you're getting lazy. I'm sick of it. Lightning's got the door every time for the last seven weeks and he's proper stressed. At least do something yourself or it'll be a shock court for you. Oh, and about Lightning, you'll be my solicitor. But I paid the 1.2 million pounds for the fucking mouse. So I have the say of who does what. Really? You paid all 1.2 million pounds? Then how do you explain the fact that Silver has 200,000 pounds less? I'm half a million down, and Prince Thunder paid out another half a million. You are nothing but a conniving, thieving, lying, lazy, bullying, blackmailing, shit-stirring or swipe. Fine, I stole it from you all to pay for this house. But I'm paying the gas, water, and electric bills and don't fucking lie to me. Angel Tidal Wave, Flutters, Shockwave, and Lightning are paying for that too. If you don't shut up, Sonic, I will have you kicked out. He's not coming back anytime soon. I've thrown his shit away. In fact, he's living in a hostel from now on, meaning Lyra can take his room. Sorry you had to hear it, Shockwave. But he stole our money to pay for this house. We're seeing him in Ishaga Court, with Lightning as my solicitor. That was tiring, and thank you, Ringo, for setting up the sofa into your bed for me. It's really comfortable. It's okay, you were gone for a while, giving me plenty of time. And now that I'm really tired, I think I'd better sleep. But today was just amazing, my first day here, and I feel at home already. I think today was just quality, and now I ought to sleep. See you in the morning, guys.